Hey guys, and welcome back to Twitchy Plays Alien Isolation, where my main objective is to get through a main door or something. Just trying to spin around, remember where I am. Uh, we have come through all sorts of trials and tribulations, but mainly we have come through the departures language because we got stuck there for like ever. Forever and ever and ever. There's water on the floor here. And uh, what are we looking for now? Well, we are trying to make our way through the main door. But who knows which door it actually even means is the main door. We find ourselves in a weird little offshoot of a map here. So we can't even check that. But I'm going to go through and just see if there's anything here that I can use to contact the vessel. The Torrens that was outside. Look, look, here we go. What's this? Chris, it's Turner. Gotta deal with that wasted asshole again. This time he nearly wrecked the door with a maintenance jack. Guess he figures it's safe here. He wants to lock himself in. Screw him. We got too much to worry about without babysitting drunks. Anyway, I threw him in the evidence lockup. Let the son of a bitch sleep it off. Okay, so I know that we need a maintenance jack for stuff. Uh, the the stuff in particular is trying to make our way through a door. Um, let's go and have actually a look at that. Oh look, there's a light on here. Can we? Oh, I can hide in here. Why would I want to hide in here? What's the deal with this, eh? Alright, let's open this back up. It's a bit of a jerky animation to get in and out of there, but, you know, whatever. We'll, we'll deal with that. So, we are looking around for a doorway, for an exit, for anything that just gives us some sort of clue as to what we're doing. I mean, that said about the uh, the, the evidence, Jack, because this, this was the, the one that we're supposed to get through. Right? If we come up, walk up to here, it's like, you need a maintenance, Jack. So, I'm guessing wherever that guy was being stored, maybe over this way, is where we're going to find the maintenance, Jack. This is all baggage claim still. Uh, that's, that's pretty cool. Can we get through this door? Is this a thing? We need a plasma torch. Well, that's where we actually need the plasma torch. Uh, plasma torches and ion torches have both been talked about here. There's nothing really around here. Do you reckon I can get through here? Is this something that can happen? No, no, it's not something that can happen. It's a, it's a, a great shame. It's a great shame. Uh, I'm not sure what's going on around this way. I can't even remember which way I came into this room. I think it was via this door. Yeah, this looks relatively... Yeah, I came crawling through this. Alright, I, I know where I am. Don't, don't question me. I know what's going on here. Uh, so, <clears throat> looking for... Some way of keeping people like captive. Is there like anything up here we get to look at? Like this looks fairly interactive. No, no, of course not. It's the beeping. Can you hear that beeping? If it's that, I don't know. I don't know what it is. Uh, well, we can't interact with it, so who knows? It's just something to put us on our on our toes, right? Okay, so. Can I hear singing? I can hear some piano music somewhere. Who knows where it is? I think it's coming out of here. It's coming out of here. <laughs> anyway, that's that's not important. What? <laughs> why? Why would you let me get distracted with that, guys? What's what's going on? Eh? Can we open this door? We can open this door. Ooh. Oh yeah, right. So it's this room. Okay, cool. Uh, so, I've already explored both sides. In fact, I pumped open this, this uh, power generator here, to get this door open on the other side here. Also that door. Um, I'm not sure why we wanted this place open, but obviously, as we've opened it, we've, there's bound to be something here, right? There's bound to be. If we, if we have opened it, then there's going to be a reason for it. Well, this is, this is my thought, anyway. I love, I love this symbol. <laughs> Everyone is responsible for safety. Yeah, yeah. Everyone's responsible for their own safety. All right. So it's pretty much all just like destroyed stuff here. We need another maintenance jack. Is this a door I can get through? Is is that something that can happen? No, nah, big big lock door. I should have known. Really, should have known. It's all very dark and, and murky around here, isn't it? I can peek around here. No, no, nothing. Nothing in there that we really want to get to at this present moment in time. <clears throat> Not sure what we are looking for. Uh, wrong button, this one. Let's have a look around. I don't, I don't see anything. There's a door with a light on it. Now, lights are normally indicators that we can get through, right? Let's, let's go and have a look. A plasma torch is required. That's terrible. So this looks like a room we could get into. Is this a door here? No, it's not a door. Oh, that's a shame. It's the problem with these real murky dark points. You can't quite find out, uh, see what's going on in the background, or at least what door is which. Oh, look, there's a. What's going on in there? 
There are lights on the wall. It looks like all sorts of stuff going on in there. Maybe there's even a party of some description. Hi, I'm talking. What? Are we going to end up spending forever looking around for an event that doesn't exist again or something? I don't know. I don't know. Trying to get my way through the main door. Not particularly easy. So what, what does the map say about this point? It says there's a lot of uh, points to look at. Like, what's that? And what's these two? Points to look at, eh? Points to look at. Well, let's go and have a look at... See what that is. Is that over that way? It is over that way. We are looking directly at it. Oh, it's the maintenance check. Damn it. Well, that's a little bit annoying. So where can we go? I don't, I don't know where we can go. Obviously going to be something somewhere. Baggage claim. Do we have a security room? Departures. Passenger lounge. I'm looking for like an evidence locker or something like that. Should we go back to the room with the uh, tape in it? Maybe that will have something in it there. Um, I don't know. I just kind of, I want to rip all these bags open and see what people have got. Maybe, maybe someone's got something useful. Probably not though. Probably not. Um, checking out some signs. Just see, just see what's going on. See the noise? What's that noise? Oh, I'm, I'm a little bit jumpy. A little bit jumpy. I mean, as, as you're going to be playing a game like this. Yep, as you're going to be playing a game like this. <laughs> okay, so I found that tape player up there. Maybe that maybe there's something else up there. Um, not sure what else we could possibly be doing. <laughs> Once again, this uh, over-eloquent graffiti. Definitely uh, putting its point across... Oh, we can't jump. I keep trying to jump. It's no good. Hello. What have we got here? It's another girly magazine. Door's opened. Did you hear that door open? Was it a door opening? A door closing? Who knows? Who knows? Let's, let's come up here. Looters will pay. But what are we supposed to be looting? This is the question. This is the question. Uh, if I was a man with an evidence locker, where would I keep stuff? Like, that? that was somewhere to hide. Didn't really grab anything from there. Oh, what's this? There we go. Another door. Looks um, looks dodgy. Looks dodgy. I can't believe I completely like missed that door on the first walkthrough. I can, well, I can, I can. If like you guys have been watching my playthrough, you know that I miss stuff like this. Um, I, I'm sorry for the frustration that causes. I know, I know how bad it is when you like you've seen something on the side of the screen somewhere, and the guy playing the game is just like, "Oh, I can't see anything. What's going on around here?" Yeah, sorry about that. Oh, look, there's a vent. Do you reckon that's where we're supposed to go? I'd like to look through doors and stuff first, if possible. Uh, oh, jeez. Look at that. Oh, mate. Oh, look. What's he got there? He's got something on him. Should we? Uh, should we sneak our way through? It ah, oh, it looks scary. It looks terrifying. I'm, I'm not particularly looking forward to going in in here. Uh, so there's a nice ladder way up. I don't, is that is that where I want to go? Must be. There's no other way of going. Who knows what we are going to encounter here? I mean, something killed that guy, right? Uh, Sparky's everywhere. Uh, uh. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm not feeling the vents. <laughs> vents. Vents are definitely a scary play. Like, if anything comes to get me... <coughs> Shit. Right over there. Fell through the... How am I supposed to get up back through there? How am I supposed to get... Should we, should we listen to what this guy has to say? Hello? I want to make a complaint. To the, the highest authority, okay? <laughs> yeah, I make, yeah, make you complain. That's Watson. That's I think Watson. I need this one. You get that? My complaint is this. Fucking marshals. They should be protecting us. It's their job. Something's on this station with us and no one knows what it is. No one fucking knows. They put braces on the doors. Locked down. You know, like to keep something out. I'm fucking terrified, man. I'm fucking... Shit. He's not the only one. Wow. Well, that's terrifying. Oh my god. Um, there, There is something in the station with us. I wonder what it could be. Uh, I, oh, gee. Okay, so, somewhere in here, no. Okay, um, do I just say, yes, I've got the, dra the jacknet? Yeah, it is a case of, yes, I've got the jacknet. Oh, Jesus. 
Just smash that padlock, why don't you? Uh, hold both the buttons, okay. And press A. Oh jeez, A's all the way over here. Okay, we could do this. We could do this. The multi-press activities. Um, I, I, I can do it. I know where all the buttons are. We should be alright. Okay, so we can now open these doors. Which is going to lead to all sorts of trouble. I mean, you just know it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to open a door one day and something's going to jump out at me and I'm going to be like, ah! Um, okay, so with all those doors going on, should we find out what this uh, this log was about? Uh, not the log, the ID tag. Do we... Like, the missing is something we're supposed to be looking for? Is it up up this way? Uh, oh, look, I've missed something. Ooh, that's not good. I wonder what that is. Okay, so that's no good. Is it in here anywhere? No, I'm not sure. Press R to activate what? Oh, the flare, okay. Right. I don't want to activate the flare. I want, I want the medicate in my hand. Ah, 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 I don't want that in my hand. How do we get rid of it? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe if we go and use this door, it will stop. Yes, yes it will. Ooh. So we press those two together and move this across. All right, so it's just a simple bolt. That should be fine. Dealable. More than dealable. We're just going to go around and check each individual room and hopefully not die. I really would like to know what the deal with that ID tag was. I mean, what what was the deal with the ID tag? I, I picked it up. It must be there somewhere. Um... No, 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 none of these. There are lots of stuff I've missed here. I'm not, I'm not impressed by that. Not impressed by that at all. But none of these say, uh, I deal with another wasted arsehole again, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, no, nah, we, we did that. That's fine. Um, yeah, and this guy complaining to the highest authority. Well, obviously, we've missed it then. Um, none, none of these. Ah, here. Zed Watson. How, how do we highlight this? We use the arrow keys, of course. Why, why would we not? If only I could figure out how to use it. Okay, so, Mr. Zed Watson, he is in freight shipping. Oh, look, he's got an ID code. I wonder when we need to use that. How do I get rid of this thing out of my hand? I can't. I can't. That's annoying. Oh, look, we can collect some scrap. Look, no, what are you doing? All right, so I can climb under this table, can I? Oh, well, that's... Um, that's not very useful at all, actually. I was going to say that that's useful, but it's not. It's not even slightly useful. There's another flare to grab. Um, uh, we will listen. In fact, let's put this on to listen to. Interview subject. Heist. Did I say that right? Heist? Look, if you can't even tell me your name, we're going to be here a hell of a long time. A hell of a long time. I just want to know about your boss. He's got you all into a lot of trouble. Someone's going to be accountable. I'm going to make damn sure someone's accountable. So who is this talking? No. Tough guy, huh? Turner, turn off the tape. Who's Turner? Maybe our friend here is just shy. Wow, that's confusing. So, obviously someone... There was some like underworld activities on the go or something. I mean, there's always underworld activities on the go. Uh, everyone's trying to make a buck if they can, right? Okay, what have we got over here? We didn't actually come into this room. Oh, God, look at it. It's covered in blood and stuff. Well, I, I, it's got red on it, and I presume that's blood. So this looks a bit... Look at this. What's going on here? Uh, I can't wait. Led to us? Lied. Wait's lied to us. Oh dear. What's this? That looks scary. Anyway, should we uh, have a look? What's the bee? What's the bee about? No. Anything back here to hide? No. No. All right. Well, it's a big empty room. <laughs> it's very atmospheric. I don't. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Should we? Uh, should we run away? There doesn't appear to be anything to actually have from this room. Oh well. That's a shame. That is a great shame. I'm gonna go back through here. Oh, we're back in the beepy room. Bloody hell's that noise. There best not be things after me, I tell you. I would not be happy. Can we can we look out here and see anything? I see nothing. Do you guys see anything? Lots of spooky noises. I mean, we have definitely seen something running around out here at some point. There was that one one brief view of something out the corner of my eye. Now, do we want to go over there and have a look over there before we carry on? I, I, I believe this place, was it? Yeah, look, he's got a couple of 
couple of dodgy rooms to go look in. I mean, that's our objective, but I think I think I'd really like to go look around the side rooms. Um, let's let's get our move on. Let's get let's get going quickly. Um, what could we possibly see in here? Yeah, in in here was definitely the way we want to be. So we're into the baggage collection. There was definitely a couple of rooms to check out up here. Um, this one over here, yeah, seems safe, right? Seems safe. I should use this peeking thing more often. I could uh, stick my head around the outside and see what's going on. Okay, so what's what are we gonna do in here? What are we gonna find? In here? Hopefully, we're gonna find one of those. Um, SCJ injectors or whatever it is, so we can build ourselves another med kit. I would also like some more. Oh, wrong button. I also like some more uh, schematics for stuff. I'd like to build extra things, like a med kit. Yep, yeah, it's all good. But you know, maybe some sort of stun gun wouldn't go amiss. I feel pretty, pretty exposed running around here with nothing but a flare to defend myself with. Okay, what have we got here? Ethanol. Ethanol is good. Maybe we could just like sit back and have a drink. I wouldn't mind sitting back and having a drink. Can we turn this on? Ah, no. What's over here? We've got some scraps. Blasting caps. Wow, nice. Okay. Uh, over here, nothing, nothing. Uh, the main reason I want like extra things to do with my stuff is because uh, if we come in here and have a look at this, look, look at all these sensors we've got and nothing to do with them. What do we do with the sensors? Who knows? Who knows? Well, I've got a feeling I know. You know, having watched movies, I know there is a uh, vital piece of equipment that would probably in, uh, probably use a sensor. But you know, that's uh, that's kind of meta gaming, right? Which way did we go? That way doesn't need a brace. That needs a plasma arc. What about this one? Uh, let's get up and run. Is this just a? Yeah, that's the ion torch. Okay, so this is obviously all locked rooms. Uh, that's a shame. That is a shame. We got into one room and we got some ethanol. I'm just gonna. Was that? What was that? I don't. I don't like it. I don't like it. Ah. Plasma torch. Okay, just had to double check that. Still nothing in this side, right? Like we can't use the the, the maintenance jack to bust this open or anything like that. No, I bet we're gonna end up on the other side of it at some point. In fact, I bet we're gonna end up on the. Other... Those door noises. Wow, they catch me out every time. Okay, so we're just going to run down and see if we can't get through that main door. That is our next objective. <laughs> I'm making myself jump now. Those little bits came out the side. I was like, no, <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> okay, let's get up. Uh, open door number 42. What, what else could we possibly want to do at this point? So, oh, we cut ceiling. Oh, don't do it. Ooh. Stay still. Someone with a gun. Okay. Okay. Now, turn around. Someone with a Scottish accent. Come on! All right, love. Leave me be. Ah, I just opened that. I'm Ripley. Where'd you come from? Ripley. Off station. A ship. There's no ships here. There I, are I came. I came on one. Well, <laughs> that's good news. Because things are not so good here. Something blue just now. Rocked this whole place. I saw it. Yeah. Ah. Uh. But lady, that's the least of our problems. Yeah? Yeah. Something's on this station. Something. Something's here. Something you wouldn't believe. Like what? I bet I would. You get it? Okay. <laughs> just put the gun down, mate, please. Okay. There's the thing of things to worry about. Why are you What's pointing that at me? Axel. Hi, right, Axel. I was boarding with two colleagues. EVA. We got separated by the blast. Can you help me find them? Why? Because you seem to know your way around. No, I mean, why? What's in it for me? The place on the ship. Love. No. <laughs> How did I know I can trust you? I need to find comms. I need to contact my ship. <laughs> can I can I not have the gun this instead, please? It's your lucky day. All right. Let's go, sweetheart. Well, where Six are we going? Comms is in the Cystex bio. It's quite a distance, but we can get to a transit through the freight area. But which, watch yourself. Which way's the freight area? We can get into all sorts of trouble there. Okay. 
All right, I, I want to speak to you. There we go, so we can see you. Hello, Axel. How are you doing? You seem like an absolute arsehole. That's to be said. All right, let's 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 get our way through here. Come on, I don't want to stick around here long. I don't want to stick around here either. Oh, jeez. I mean, we could save it at this point. We could save it at this point. We are technically at the end of an episode. Okay, well, I think we might see what's behind this door. I think we might see what's behind this door. What do we have behind this door? We have some swirling fans... We have a long, dark corridor. And I'm going to take this opportunity to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, guys. I will see you next time when we're going to go find out what's down there and possibly see like how Axel dies. i got a feeling he's going to die very, very soon. Uh, okay, I'm going to save it. And I will see you then when we're going to do that. Bye!